Thank you for joining me in Christ Watchman Ministry. I'm so happy to have you. It's a blessing, it's a joy, and it's a passion that the Lord has put in my heart to serve Christ by serving you. All because in the last days, God shall part of spirit, and sons and daughters of prophecy. But more importantly than that, a lot of people in the last days are going to give heed to see the spirits and doctrines of demons. So what we're going to talk about here in this ministry, you're going to see how fulfilled prophecy is happening right before our eyes. You're going to see how Revelation 17 happened with Pope Benedict resigning. You're going to see how Pope Francis fulfilled Revelation 17, 11. You're going to see so much that the church today is not talking about and pastors not talking about because they're focused on money and, and just uh, routine and not trying to fear make the church scared but the Lord talked about it should we should too in fact you can trust this ministry so much because check this out in this study here that you'll see in the card just check out the card you'll see here I talked about watch for Pope Francis to meet Prince Hassan a, a Prince Hassan of Jordan and I said that in June 27th and it came to pass on September 4th so here something the Lord taught I said it Boom, it happened. What does scripture say about that? When the word of the prophet comes to pass, one whom that you shall know that this is whom the Lord has sent. Now, not a prophet, because the scripture says he shall pour out a spirit, sons and daughters of prophecy. That's what he said. And you see that this is for edification, exhortation, and for comfort. But besides that, also, we're going to talk about the royals, because all throughout the year, since Pope, became, Pope Francis became the Pope, a lot of royals been abdicating one after the other. And this is all going to lead towards the ten horns, which is prophesied, Daniel's 2's prophecy, prophecy of the ten toes, which means we need to watch out for the Queen of England and Queen of Denmark to be replaced by kings. We've got to watch out for them. But there needs to be a king in Denmark and a king also in your UK. And then we're going to also, if you doubt this teaching, which you can also find here, is that I said on May 6th, as by the leading of the Holy Spirit, watch out for these two queens to be replaced by kings. I said that on May 6th, uh, 2013. And the Lord confirmed this teaching because two days later it was on the news. Uh, queen prepares Prince Charles for the throne. So you can see the Lord is definitely in this ministry. His hand is in his teaching. I'm listening to him and I'm telling you the church what he says because I love you and I love him and I serve him by serving you. Uh, so we're going to talk more about uh, the North Africa and West Asia and Prince Hassan bin Talal of Jordan and Pope Francis, uh, both of which is the rider, uh, Prince Hassan being the rider and Pope Francis being the white horse, and just fellowship with me, folks. I I'm here to serve you. Please support this ministry, if you especially if you see fruits, especially if you see the Lord. It's validating what he's saying through this ministry for you. Support the ministry. Amen? Because there's so much happening, and let's do good work for the Lord. Let's get in the field and work in the field before the harvest. Amen? Before Mass returns. And we got to give an account. So God bless you. Check out the whole ministry right below you, all the different uh, videos I got going on under there. And uh, I hope to fellowship with you all and talk to you later.